NYC is planning to convert a soccer field on Randall's Island into a shelter for 2,000 illegals. Look at that. Yeah. At least they're not taking from the black community, right? This is definitely a, a, a Hispanic sport right here. Look at that. Four soccer fields, guys. That's a lot of recreational space. Do you know how much more crime there's going to be if kids don't get their recreational activity? I was never arrested for, for well, I never got into, um, bad things until i left track and field i was i was a discus thrower a frost soft champion and then my coach turned into an asshole so i stopped throwing and then guess what next year i got busted dope dealing yeah that's my life new yorkers are about to lose more park space to illegal border crossers last week it was reported that the city is considering housing illegals in central park residents in brooklyn are fuming because the city just opened a shelter in a popular neighborhood park where kids play those are two other stories I just covered. Now, the public park in Randall's Island is going to lose its soccer fields as the city plans another shelter to house 2,000 people. Wow, guys. Wow. New York City will open a shelter for migrants on Randall Island some nine months after officials closed a similar center that housed asylum seekers in the East River Park. Adam said the new space will house roughly 2,000 adults adult asylum seekers officials said the new site will open in the coming weeks along with two other new relief centers in other parts of the city as the number of asylum seekers in our care continues to grow by hundreds every day stretching our system to its breaking point and beyond it has become more and more of a herculean effort to find enough beds every night uh, city officials said there are now more than fifty-seven thousand migrants under the city's care wow look at that Oh, such a nice park. We're going to watch that video when we get over to kick only. Oh, that's kind of nice. Look at that. It's got a bridge over it. That's kind of cool. I think that looks awesome when I see stuff like that. You usually see a grass field and there's nothing around. Oh, no, a big bridge. Look at that. Construction of the housing means 3,000 hours of recreation for both public and private school children, as well as adult sport leagues, would be canceled, which means a lot more kids are going to go more delinquent. Okay. Put your, if you want your kids to come out okay, put them in sports. Okay, sports will keep them out of trouble. Extracurricular activities will get, keep them out of trouble. You can't be there for them right after they get out of school. Okay, so it's either they're gonna be they're gonna have hood rat friends or athlete friends, one or the other. Emergency shelters are going up on Randall's Island soccer fields used by hundreds of New York City school children. The state is picking up the tab. You mean the taxpayers are? Construction crews are laying the foundation for the. Wow, they're actually gonna dig this thing up, huh? Are laying the foundation for the new migrant mega shelter on Randall's Island. Wow, that sucks. That's a lot. That's gonna be. That's gonna create a lot more Hispanic gangs now. Cause um, they got nothing to do. Can you even imagine that the city is going to look like in a year? Wow. We'll watch these videos when we get over to uh, Kick. Okay. I can't play them here on YouTube because of reused content policies. Huh?